Hey you, what's going on? No, you're looking all sad walking past my room. What what happened? Oh, come in. Yeah, you can close the door. Go ahead. So what's going on? Oh, anxiety. No, no, it's okay, it's okay. Just stay calm. Calm and explain to me what's going on. Yeah. Yeah, with everybody coming over. Yeah, I can see being worried about everybody uh, being loud and all that, especially when you're in like a fragile state at the moment. It can, it can kind of add to it. Mm-hmm. Yeah, don't, don't uh, worry about that. You know, we'll make sure everything's all right. Um, and you can always come up to your room if you need to get away from everyone for a little bit. I'm sure it'll be fine. <laughs> There's going to be a good amount of people. So if you need time away, it's not like you have to solely entertain one person anyway. Best to do what's good for you. Um, and yeah, why don't you get changed into your pajamas and come back and we can have like a little like self-care evening and you can just talk about everything that's been going on. Okay, that sounds good. Yeah. Alright, you go do everything you have to do to get ready and I'll just pull some things together. Okay. All right, see you in a minute. Okay, welcome back to my room. Just get comfortable. Wherever you want to sit on the bed is fine. And I've got some things that we can do to hopefully make you feel a little bit better tonight. And then hopefully you will sleep well too. Um, and just know that like if anything goes on while everyone's here, you can always come to me or I can, you know, like I said, you can escape to your room and I can make reasons up, excuses for why you're not down there at the moment, okay? All right, but we still have a little less than a week and luckily nobody's staying at our house, so it's just for the few hours. Yeah. Are there any foods you're looking forward to having? Yeah, I love the rolls too. Okay. Let me see where I want to start. I feel like we should wash your face first and then I can kind of get into like the face masks and working on your hair after that, okay? Okay, so let's put the cute little bow headband on. Sorry, it has some of my hair on it. <laughs> so we'll put that on you. Okay. Good. And... We'll begin with the... No, I'm using my stuff on you. Is that okay? Alright. Um, the Brightening Witch Hazel, Vitamin C, Niacinamide, and Pumpkin, Aloe Vera, and Rose Formula. It's got cute little pumpkins on it. So this is just a toner, and this is what I use as my cleanser. Let's get a cotton pad. This is the last one in the bag. Alright. So I'm just going to put some of that on here. Don't 
ain't too much. It goes a long way. And you just wipe this over your skin. skin down your nose how has school been going is that what's adding to your anxiety mm-hmm and then we'll go down your neck Yeah. That can be difficult when a friend starts seeing somebody and then, yeah, throws off the whole dynamic of a group, but it happens. <laughs> That's something that happens and it is like a matter of finding a balance. It's difficult, but it's something everybody's got to grow through. And sometimes people come back or they come to a point where they can work other people in again, but just everybody's growing and learning. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Okay, so this is a dry one now, and what I do is I just pat this around to pick up the excess. I can't remember if it says that on the bottle. I don't know why I started doing this, but it keeps my face from, like, getting the hair stuck to it and everything and obviously it's it's fine it's doing something because I'm I don't have too many well I don't know if I have any breakouts right now aside from like maybe some on my neck down there but yeah this stuff this stuff's been working for me but let's see if it says that on there so good before so Pat dry and follow with your usual serum. So it does say pat dry, so that's that's what we do. So it says to follow with the serum and the moisturizer in that order, but I do the moisturizer first. And typically I use the serum when I get out of the shower because my skin gets dry, so I use this as like a hydrator after I get out of the shower and it does make my skin soft but we're going to use it after the moisturizer because I want to use that uh, facial massager on you so we'll use the serum to kind of help um, everything glide around okay so this is my moisturizer and it's from the same company um, this is the glow up face cream vitamin C and pineapple it does smell like pineapple if you want to what is brightening complexion japanese wakame wakame i would assume and fruit aha but it does smell pineapple to me so we'll use some of that on you just a little bit we don't need a lot And so I just dot it around and then spread it that way. Lift your head again. I'm going to put them on your neck. Good. Good. And that should soak in real well. I don't have any issues with it when I use it. Um, but... I'll do mine when I'm ready for bed. Yeah, being in 
large groups right now isn't for you then, huh? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, it does feel like lately lots of stuff is overwhelming, so I I get it. Is there anyone you're excited to see them if they come to Easter? Mm-hmm. Yeah, maybe you could do a puzzle together. That would be relaxing. I could put you guys off in like a separate room. Yeah, set up the puzzle table. That'll be fun. Alright, let's work at that in a little bit. Yeah, it's been a long time since we've done a puzzle, but that one we did was really, really nice. Forgot how relaxing it is, but I also forgot how much time you lose when you work a puzzle. Yeah, I think I spent five hours on it one day. I didn't get anything done. <laughs> okay, so this does um, vibrate, so it will be making a noise. Is that okay? All right. I thought the battery was stuck for a second. So just relax as I do this. Back down. I'm going to do it right across here, okay? Any jaw muscles. Unclench your jaw a little bit. There you go. Just relax. Relax. Okay, how was that? Yeah, I thought that might feel good on your temples and your jaw muscle. I know when I get stressed, I clench my jaw quite a bit. Put that away. Okay, now that we've done that, we could do... I have a couple of face mask options here. I've got the Generation Clay. This one you will have to rinse off in the bathroom though, but if you don't want to get up and move, then we will do the hydrating one. And this one, it should just seep into your skin and absorb. 
seep is kind of a creepy word, isn't it? Seep into your skin. <laughs> it will absorb into your skin and you can leave it on overnight. So that way you don't have to worry about taking it off. You'll be fresh and rehydrated, rejuvenated, hopefully, by the morning. You just need to take some time for yourself and sit. And we'll just do this nice stuff to help you calm your mind. And I also have a lip mask. Would you like to do that as well? I haven't used this one in a little bit. It's not your granny's apple. It smells so good. I know. I figured you'd like that one. I do have two other ones, but I haven't opened those yet. This one, though. You're not supposed to eat it. But, like, my mouth is watering right now because it smells so good. <laughs> Alright, so we'll do the face mask, then that. And then... I'll work on your hair. How about that? Okay. Sounds good. Oh, I wanted to ask you, do you want a little stroop waffle? Okay, yeah. I need to do video with this for TikTok, but I figured we could have one now. I'm gonna have to see if I have some sort of scissors or so. I don't want to damage the box. These are the little, little mini ones. Yeah, you can have one. If you want more, you can have more too. But I figured before we put the lip mask on, that would be a nice little treat. I'll have one too. There's 32 in here, but there's only 30 now. Shh. <laughs> supposed to be 32 in there. Yeah, I'd say maybe have it now. So if I put the face mask on, you're not gonna like get crumbs in the face mask. Do you know how weird that would be? I never thought about that before. Oh, I love her lip there. I've only never had the big ones. So when I saw that there were minis, I was like, yes, please give me the minis. I make a mesh all over my shelf. <laughs> the caramel and vanilla ones are so good. They have other ones too, and I had no idea. I'm just going to offer you a water because I typically have an extra in here, but I don't have one over here right now. So sorry about that. If you want water, though, I can get you some. Okay, so I'm going to use the hydrating mask on you. Just apply that. I don't know if those are planes or trucks. Do you know if there's construction going on? I have no clue. <laughs> yeah, 
I have no idea. go just a thin layer so it can absorb because you do already have the moisturizer on your face we don't want to over hydrate you know yeah that would not be good all right then the lip mask is there anything else you want to talk about while we're here together before you go to sleep get something off your mind take one lid Mm -hmm. Oh, you've been talking to somebody? How's that going? Oh, that's part. Oh, that's a, probably a good part then, huh? The anxiety. Okay, one second. Let me put this on you. Okay, and you can just smack that into your lips there. Oh. Mm -hmm. Okay, so what I would say then is you probably should not keep talking to that person because it doesn't seem like they're making you a priority and they're keeping you guessing and it it's obviously stressing you out mm. yeah i know it's difficult especially when it's like one of your first people you're interested in one of your yeah one of your first crushes or so um but yeah, you just have to remember, like, your worth, your value, and everything, and don't let, don't let anyone make you feel less than that, okay? Alright. I know, it will be difficult, especially if, to, if you have to see them all the time at school, but, uh, I know you'll make good decisions. Yeah. And you're strong. It's, it, it is weird. Trust me, I've been in situations like that. All right, let's take this off. I won't let your hair get in your face mask. And then you have your hair up, so let's take the scratching down. Yeah, if you ever want to talk more about that, like, we can. Okay, yeah. Yeah, so your nerves are just kind of shot then, huh? Yeah. Alright, I'm gonna brush your hair. And they have my hair oil. What exactly are you? A hair serum for anti-frizz. So I figured we could put a little bit of it on your scalp. It says mainly to keep it on the ends, but then I can give you a little bit of a head massage. Yeah. It'll help you relax too. been brushing your hair. Okay, yeah, you have to remember to brush your hair. I know when you're not feeling the best, it's easy to kind of let stuff like that go. So I've probably been throwing it up, huh?
I you know we are kind of close to the wall. I'm trying not to punch the wall. That would be bad. That would be real bad if I punched the wall. refresh there and then I'll put some of this in and I'll give you a head massage okay all right do I have gloves over here you know how weird I am with stuff on my hands yeah I just don't like sometimes when things have fragrance like this one's very strongly rosemary or something like that. It kind of gives me headaches. But I'm going to apply some of this to your scalp, okay? Just a couple of drops here and there. We don't want to overdo it. It'll be a nice little scalp treatment. And then... Give you a head massage. Let's do a couple around the front here. Go. It'll be okay. I'll be fine. I'll wash my hands after. It's stuff that like lingers that really gives me headaches. It's crazy. But okay, let's see. Head massage. I don't mean to be shaking your vision. I know that happens sometimes. You know, when our mom gives us head massages, it's like the <laughs> shaking the earth kind. Yeah. Although they are relaxing still, but... I'm gonna focus around your temples. I didn't already say that. And then... I'll go at, like, the base of your... Like, where your head and your neck meet. Yeah, I hold a lot of tension there. There you go. Just relax. Breathe. Have you been doing your Finch app? You should be. <laughs> what did you name yours? Flower. That's cute. I was gonna say I haven't received them. Um, what are those called? What are they called? Like when you can send somebody like that you're thinking of them or reminding them to drink some water or exercise. What is going on with my sweatshirt? Sorry, you have to look at that. It's pilling or something. Yeah. But when you can send the little things to say you're thinking of somebody. Yeah, you haven't sent me one in a while. <laughs> Finchie is doing just fine. He, um... I don't know how many adventure days I've been on. I feel like 400 and something? No. Maybe even more than that. It's kept me consistent, that's for sure. It's really helped. Okay. 
Okay, around your forehead. Is this helping? Good. I think we're gonna have to brush your hair again. I've kind of messed it up. Do you see my nail is like shiny now? I mean, not that it wasn't before. There's a lot of oil on it. <laughs> Alright, let's brush your hair again. I definitely did mess her hair up. <laughs> Whoopsie, it's okay. figure out what you're going to be wearing on Easter. Yeah, I figured uh, finding, I figured sorting that out now would help take off a little bit of stress. Um, I actually have this sweater that I don't mind if you want to borrow it. It is pretty plain. It's not like super exciting, but it's this white sweater from Old Navy. I haven't worn it yet, but it's white. You can't go wrong with white or cream. It's like in between white and cream. It's, it's <laughs> What's the in between? Anyway, it's nice. It's, you can't go wrong. Like I said, can't go wrong with white. So I don't mind if you want to borrow this or keep it. It's totally fine. It's just a random plain sweater. I have a ton of them. So I won't miss it. It's no worries. Oh! My Stroopwafel packaging <laughs> fell on me. Yeah, and then just a pair of jeans. Just a simple. And then, yeah, you could probably put a necklace with it or so. I don't have anything out right now. I honestly don't know where my jewelry even is because I don't wear a ton of it, so... The, um, the set, the one with the stars and the moon. Yeah, if I can find that, you can wear that. I think that would go nicely with it. Yeah, and that's comfortable to be bopping around the house in any way, like jeans and the sweater. You'll you'll be pretty comfortable. It's it's loose. It's not confining. So that will probably help you out too. Yeah, yeah. Okay, good. Yeah, you can take that then into your room and hang it up so it'll be ready. And. I think that was like everything I had planned for relaxing activities anyway. Do you want me to put your hair back up? Okay. 
I'll just do a messy bun for now. Scoop it all up. your hair. It's fighting back. And I'll look at how massive the scrunchie is. It's a little too messy of a bun. Have you been using your conditioner? Really? Okay. Yeah, it's um... Maybe you need a trim. That's what it is, probably. Because you haven't had your hair cut in a while. Let's get that out of your face. There you go. Alright. It may not be as cute as the one you had in, but you're going to sleep on it anyway. <laughs> Activity I figured we could do for the evening as a relaxing kind of thing. Again, it has to do with it has to do with something kind of messy, slime. Um, I couldn't remember if you liked slime or not, but I figured it would be a sensory kind of thing to help distract your mind, maybe take your mind off of stuff. Uh, I do have puzzle mat, which is my favorite, so I'm probably gonna do this one, play with that one, and then I have creepy kawaii, which I figured is more your vibe. It does have, they're like little stones, they're crunchies, and then it has little chips of ghosts and gravestones, but I, it's like they've all disappeared because they're definitely in there, but I only see those two on the bottom. <laughs> So those are definitely in there. And if, uh, this one smells like pink sugar, by the way. Yeah, I nearly forgot that they had smells. And then I also have this one, which is kind of like a, a Play-Doh texture, if I'm honest. Um, it's sparkly and yeah, wet, like a wet Play-Doh texture. So that might be a little strange for you. I'm not sure if you'd like that, but it smells like fresh linen, clean clothes. So this one's nice if you like that smell. That could be relaxing, um, even comforting. So if you want to play with one of those, otherwise you can play with puzzle mat, but I really want to, I want to play with this one. The pink sugar, creepy kawaii. Yeah, I did figure you'd like that one more. Let's see. Oh, there's some of the pieces. Look at it. Doesn't look like Pepto Bismol. It also looks just like a bunch, uh, like a pool of chewing gum. And I just ruined it by putting my hand on it, but you know. Yeah, so that's interesting. You'll probably like that one. I don't know what just fell in my room, but. <laughs> okay, yeah, you can put it that one. If you want to switch to the other one, you can, but I, I don't I don't think you're going to like the texture of that one. Just knowing you, I don't think you're going to like it. Try to get some of the oil off 
my hands. I don't want to ruin my slime. Yes, of course, you're welcome. This one confuses me because it's like all of these pieces float to the top. And the numbers all go to the bottom every time. Every time. So, pull it out. And yeah, we can just mess with these for a little bit until we go to sleep. If I can get the slime out of the container. There we go. Look. They all just go to the bottom. And then it loses its shape becomes a blob. <laughs> Slime is so weird. Yeah, I still don't really understand the hype of it. Um, this one is blue raspberry. I'm gonna smell it. I keep my sleeves out of it. I like how this one has the subtle crunches of the cubes and then the bubbles that pop. And the numbers somehow survive even though I'm like constantly smashing them in the slime. Put my sleep back. I don't want the dog hair getting into it. Be bad. Found a seven. Do you like the one you're messing with over there? Do you do breathing techniques when you're feeling a little anxious? Okay. Yeah, maybe you could try doing those as well. Yeah, the Finch app actually has some guided breathing you can do. I hate this. I hate this so much. You have to move really fast with this one. Like this, so it doesn't do that. Um, and I think they have you breathing in for four, it's four or five seconds and then out for four or five seconds. I'm pretty sure it's in four, out four. But like slow breathing, like Like that, kind of. Not like. <laughs> yeah, that would definitely not help. That would not be good. See, it gets all the air bubbles in it, but then you put it back in the container. just know I like the crunch of it. That. <laughs> I've never seen these like blocks before. They're like knockoff Lego pieces. They, and they look like they stick together side by side. I've never seen these before. Have you? Let's see. Let me see if I can all stuck in my hand. I don't think I do this. Okay, anyway. Is this, um, 
helping? <laughs> Am I helping? <laughs> okay. Yeah, I just need the reassurance sometimes because otherwise I feel like I'm just ridiculous. Which maybe I am also just ridiculous, but at least I'm trying, you know? <laughs> it's nice to feel like somebody cares and that you're thought of and all that stuff, so. I'm just trying my best. What is going on here? Okay. It really wants to stick to this hand, and now I'm concerned that the, um hair oil is contributing to this. <laughs> today, new slimes come out. Well, yeah, today. And there's one I really want. I keep wanting the ones that have like the, the pebbles, the little rocks in them. Like they're really like sand. Basically, I think it's sand. But it's supposed to act as dirt or soil, you know. Um, and I really want that one because I really want the sandy texture. I got the one you're playing with because I wanted the crunchiness of those rocks. And I mean, they are crunchy, aren't they? Yeah. But I, I want the different sounds because you know that I do the ASMR stuff. And um, I just want ones that are going to make good sounds. That's all I want. I think I've mainly gotten this off of my hands here. So I might actually put mine away. You can keep playing with that one if you want to. I also have other fidgets if you want to have some fidgets with you on Easter. You can just hold one in your pocket and like nobody has to know you even have one if you don't want to bring it out. Kind of like a secret soothing technique. <laughs> um, but yeah, if you want a slime, I can get you a slime. Just working it into a ball now. See, I think I got it all off my hands, but if I let it settle in my hands, then it's gonna re-stick and act fast. the cleanest my hands have been after playing with this slime because sometimes I'm finding the slime just on like I found it on one of my microphones the other day and I'm like what the heck <laughs> yeah okay um yeah if you're done with yours you can put it away if you'd like to otherwise you can take it to your room I don't care how long you want to messed with it for, but yeah, I thought that would be fun, maybe a little soothing. Good, yeah, I'll put the lid back on it, thank you. Alright, put that back over here. I'm soon gonna have so many slimes and it's not like, it's not like I even play with them a ton. I just have them for the sounds. I have two other ones I haven't even opened yet. Yeah, I need to do videos with those. So I was gonna bring them over here, but then I was like, mm, still have to do videos with them. So, yeah, I gotta wait on that. Alright, yeah, do you need 
the towel it off or yeah I just like to wipe my hands off because that's how I'm look I'm still finding the stuff on my hands anyway so if you are feeling all relaxed now and everything you should probably get ready for bed and just just try not to think about anything now that we've kind of turned the mind off and done all this stuff to soothe you and get you into like a sleepy state <laughs> um yeah just go crawl into bed and hopefully you'll go right to sleep if not you can come back in here and we can talk a little bit more so but Okay, yeah. and everything's gonna be fine on Easter. Everybody's gonna be, I know they're gonna be a little bit loud, but we'll find games to do and you're always able to escape if you have to. <laughs> That's the good thing about the holiday being at your house. Yeah, all right. Well, I will see you in the morning then, okay? All right, sleep well and we're gonna be okay, all right? Good night.